We have team coverage tonight from Portland and Salina after severe storms brought heavy rain, lightning and damaging winds. As of this hour, more than 30,000 people are without power in northeast Indiana and northwest Ohio and crews are still assessing damage. The Salina, Ohio mayor has declared a state of emergency to free up resources from the state of Ohio. News Channel 15's Michael Kuhn begins our storm coverage. He's live in the newsroom with how people in Salina are reacting to the powerful storms. Rod, mid-afternoon today, a possible tornado hit the east side of Salina and Mercer County. Emergency officials say eight people were hurt, seven by flying debris, and another in a car crash when a power pole fell down. A business area along Havman Road and State Road 29 has suffered the most extensive damage. A Dollar General partially collapsed, and the front doors and windows of a Dunham's were blown out. Power lines and trees were ripped up and knocked down. The entire town has been left in the dark. Crews are assessing the power outages and working to restore power, but it's not known when that'll happen. We had some damage in the western part of the county, a lot of agricultural buildings. One house was damaged. We actually had a tanker flipped on its side. Luckily, it wasn't carrying anything, so uh, we didn't have any problem with hazardous materials there. And then most of the damage is on the east side of the city of Salina. Uh, commercial area, there were some houses hit along Livingston Street, but mostly on the Hadman Road area. There's one industrial building and several commercial buildings that were hit really hard. In other areas of Mercer County, some buildings and at least one house were destroyed. We'll continue to follow the developments and assessments in Mercer County as we get that information. Live in the newsroom, Michael Kuhn, News Channel 15.